Hello everyone, I am going to make a presentation on safety instrumented systems, instruments proof testing. The video is being taken on behalf of instrumentationtools.com and automationcommunity.com. Kindly watch and subscribe. Proof testing of safety instrumented system instruments. Fully defined proof test procedures will help improve planned maintenance strategies, fault reporting capability, avoid unnecessary equipment failures, and show compliance with the safety management policy. Each plant will have a safety management to ensure the protection of the people working in the plant as well as the facilities available in the plant. So the proof testing has to go as per the maintenance procedures and get it vetted by the safety instrument, safety management team. Maybe like health and safety environment team, or it may be called in a different way in each company. So, what is proof testing? Proof testing is a test performed to reveal undetected faults in a safety instrument system. So, in case of any instrument system deterioration, the system can be restored to its designed functionality as per IEC 61511 standards. Once in the safety instrumented function shift is in service, the organization needs a clear documented regime to ensure it achieves the required integrity level over its operating life. Once the plants are alive in its working condition, the management should have a clear documented records for the proof testing of the instruments. Test frequencies are set as part of the PFD calculations and are recorded in the safety requirement specifications. Um, the, how to arrive at the test frequency? This is a calculation based on the probability of failure and demand. And that then it will detect what kind of configuration to be have in the instruments, like a 1 out of 1, 1 out of 2, 2 out of 1, 2, 2 out of 2, 2 out of 3, etc. So that will be required. The management of the testing must ensure tests are called and completed in time. Test methods must be clear and comprehensive such that a competent technician is able to complete them without any delay. So the procedure should be made clear. Engineering design also needs to have considered testing as part of the PFD calculations and should include the ability to test with the started plan conditions. Started plan conditions. Online tests using overrides. In case of any online test occurred using an override, that is also need to be captured. Okay, performing SIFT proof test and method of test varies with the configuration of the sensors, final control elements, one out of two, two out of three, two out of two, etc., and their model details like uh, like example RE phase based pressure, differential pressure level, and uh, another type of radar level. Next one is inline mass vortex flow meters, etc and pneumatically operated valves, pneumatic operated or electrically operated valves. For each of the type of uh, instruments and valves, the testing may be slightly different and also based on the type of configuration it may vary. However, below basic procedures can be performed on the sensors at a calculated frequency. This may be as early as 2 and after 3 years even if the proof test is calculated for 5 to 6 years. So sometimes it may be required to do at an early interval. Maybe this is due to the plant tripping well before the planned target date, uh, planned shutdown dates, etc. Okay, and what are the type of tests we are going uh, it is to be performed on the safety instrumented system instruments? Visual inspection of field transmitters. So this will result in this will reveal problems that are not identified by the instrument. The self diagnostic tests the instrument will remain unavailable for the function. So that means the instrument is getting taken out of the service. Uh, it will not be sorry, it will not be taken out of the service, it will keep continue to the do the protection. Only the inspection will be as a visual inspection, keeping the instrument in running condition. Wetted part inspection this is for the process lines. The instrument will remain available for its function. It will result in the instruments will be available for its function. 
with a visual inspection of flow meter configurations and time constants and k factors may get disturbed in intelligent flow instruments if proper soft lock is not programmed soft lock means internally there will be a lock so which requires some enabling key it's a like password protection this is applicable for the inline flow meters which are of the later technology like it may be like a coriolis mass flow meters vortex flow meters magnetic flow meters etc okay here again this is for the pressure sensors the proof test is being performed and the instrument technician is uh, doing the instrument flushing and then confirming all the parameters are as per the design standards okay caution for proof test methods proof test plan ought to be developed cautiously taking into consideration check if proof testing in the field is acceptable from a process point of view as per the plant area layout piping routing chemical hazards etc this is what actually when before taking the proof test it has to be ensured that like flushing of the instrument line so in this case this line may be required to be drained which may result in loss of little bit pressure so this should not have an impact for the running process so these are the different uh, requirement over here consider the below factors like electrical area classification toxicity ability to isolate reliably without impacting the run plant always it is to be taken care that the run plant shall not be disturbed for the proof testing requirement so this has to be kept in mind and ensured that the systems are running healthily for in field test procedures confirm if all the required hardware such as isolation or bypass valves either exists in the design or to be added to the design so bypass valve available in the system which for which uh, we are going to uh, the maintenance is going to do the proof testing then it is fine if there is uh, no bypass available then some alternate method to be developed before doing the proof testing so that the process can continue to work again further going on with the cautions and uh, determine if the process application requires any modification to the sys instrument maintenance procedure for example whether the testing can get impacted due to an incompatible test fluid normally the test fluids like nitrogen is being used so we, this should not get contaminated with the process fluid or process gas which is going through the sensor passing through the sensor body this has to be ensured changes to the application program requires full validation and a proof test of any sif impacted by the change there is any changes happening in the application program so it may require for a full validation okay here in this picture we are seeing the uh, inlay flow meter is being uh, tested and adjusted for the parameters and uh, the configuration is being taken up so ways to improve sis proof testing for inline flow measurements instruments heartbeat or smart meter verification self diagnostic sensor technology facilitates timely and accurate diagnostics of the instrument files these tests can do diagnostic coverage up to 98 percentage for the instruments with the later technology like coriolis coriolis meter and uh, vortex flow meter they are available with the inbuilt software known as heartbeat technology or smart meter verification which can run parallelly during the uh, processing and send a error indication for the about error indication about the any failures possible failures results of inline flow meters test results to enable targeted timely and cost effective maintenance interventions ensure safe processes with minimal process interruption drive cost effective maintenance through smart data and diagnostics wherever possible for the new facilities the management should consider to use those instruments which is having a intelligent processor and online testing can be performed without any hindrance for the running plant so the latest instruments with some manufacturers have these facilities like orbit and smart petrol verification these are all the different methods to do betterment of the sys proof testing for the field instruments thank you